Let's go. It's 3 a.m. on June 1st, 2034. Scientists inside Catalina Sky Survey in Arizona have been awake all night hunting for asteroids. Wait, that can't be right. That looks like a new fast moving point of light against the sky. Is that what I think it is? Is that what I think it is? But those city and country killers, for the country killers, they think we've only found 42 to 47% of them. And for the city killers, the number is much, much less. And we're much less certain about that percentage. That is the biggest hole in Earth's defenses right now. And that is what people all around the world are staying up all night trying to fix. And I'm about to become one of them. So we just opened the doors to the telescope. We're now all set to start the observation run. We just have to wait until it gets darker and then we can start hunting asteroids. If you find a new asteroid, you get to put your name on it. And I really, really want to do that. But it turns out finding a new asteroid is way harder than I thought. So this is a map of the night sky that shows the coverage from this telescope over about the last uh, two weeks. We'll cover the entire night sky uh, about twice a month. The telescope takes pictures of 12 spots of sky at a time, each four times in a cycle. So the four images of each spot are brief moments apart. And then an automated system analyzes each set and shows the observer just the maybe options. The vast majority of those are still no's. That's so you see the end key is a little worn down on the keyboard. <laughs> That's the key we hit the most. Okay, here I go. Not real, okay. not real. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, definitely nope. This went on for hours. David and I took turns, and I really wanted to stay awake. 